working on an interesting spin on your traditional French toast. Joining me now is uh, Linda Ridding. She is the uh, owner and creator and head pepper of uh, Perth Pepper and Pestle. That's yes. a mouthful. <laughs> yes. Where did the name yes. come from? Actually, it's funny because I was on my way into Quebec and we were deciding how we were going to name it and on our way golfing, surprisingly enough, October 1994. Mm -hmm. And it was born in, 19, in November of that year. So it just, it just rolled off the tongue and it worked. And you're a yes. golfer. Yes. I, I knew there was a reason why we got along so well. So we're looking at, at a bit of a spin on your, your traditional French yes. toast. What did you yes. start with, Linda? Actually, it's um, a recipe that will serve eight people instead mm -hmm. of just your traditional two slices per frying pan. Mm -hmm. It's cut up the night before and soaked. And at this point, what makes it really exceptional is you're always curious, how is it that you're going to cook the inside? Well, right. at this point, we don't worry about that because it's when you add the jelly. This is a pesto-infused, uh, I think it's a Belgian bread, actually, but okay. a nice firm bread actually works. Can I ask you what you soaked it in the night before? Ah, your typical egg mixture. Oh. That I've added pesto to. Okay, so, so that flavor pesto. will actually infuse right through, right to as long as, or as far into the bread, mm -hmm. that an overnight soaking will do. Okay. So at this point, you're just browning it. There's no intention of actually cooking the inside. Mm -hmm. And I'm butter in your skillet, right? Yes. Sorry to interrupt yes. you. No, okay. Yes. And so, what type of uh, jelly are you adding? This will be our roasted garlic bread pepper jelly, mm. which is actually under the Foodsmiths label. Okay. <laughs> and it's okay. nice that Foodsmiths has allowed us to come into the store today. Most certainly. Because Most certainly. You, you are responsible for creating. Um, all 17 flavors in yes. the uh, Perth Pepper and Pesto line. Library, yes, uh, of what course. Did it, what did you start with? Did you start with just one, Actually, one flavor? Actually, the mom and father, mom and dad of all these is just the original and the hot. Mm -hmm. And out of that was born, interestingly enough, for the demos that I used to do back then and all the ways I had spoken about how to use the flavors, mm -hmm. whether it's with Mexican food, uh, Chinese food, Italian food, it doesn't matter. And then I'm thinking, okay, well, why don't I just put those flavors right in into what it, into the flavors and create more. Right. So that's how those were born. Mm -hmm. And then subsequent to that, it was just a matter of how I was entertaining with red pepper jellies that I created the subsequent flavors. And your company has become exceptionally popular. I mean, we travel all across the valley in the Seaway, uh, featuring interesting stops and stores. And I cannot tell you how many oh, of wonderful. those gourmet shops carry your line and that they rave about it. It's um, um, certainly, um, it's interesting that now there's a support for local, but I've always enjoyed that um, the audience of the Valley and my products. Mm -hmm. So it's uh, the trend to local is actually improving that, and certainly um, more people are. Uh, because they're familiar with what I've done before, they're more inclined to experiment with the new flavors that I keep bringing out. Exactly. So we'll let this saute then? Actually, at this point, what we're doing is um, just a light poach on it mm -hmm. so that the um, the heat will actually cook the inside. Yeah. Uh, one of the other things, and it's just a matter of figuring out how long it's going to be, but what makes this um, really advantageous in terms of serving a large group of people is that when it's done, I can turn it off. Mm -hmm. And whenever anyone comes for for breakfast or comes down or in from fishing or walking the dog, it's ready. Okay. It, as opposed to the other way with traditional French toast, where you to serve right you've away. got to eat it right away. We've got, to, uh, sorry to, to interrupt you, we've no got problem. plenty more coming up this morning from uh, <laughs> Perth with Perth Pepper and Pestle. Uh, yes. Mother's Day uh, recipes, all coming up yes. on CTV Morning Live.